Today we shall reflect on the life of Pope Saint Peter Celestine the 5th. Peter de Morone had spent most of his life as a Benedictine hermit in the wild mountains of southern Italy when in 1294 to his great surprise he was one day visited by an immense crowd of monks and lay people led by three cardinals who announced that he had been unanimously elected pope tearfully obeying the summons to leave his beloved solitude he entered the city of aquila riding on a donkey with king charles the 2nd of naples holding the bridle on one side and charles martel of hungary on the other to the politically ambitious rulers the election of the 79 year old hermit as pope celestine the 5th was a windfall he let himself be persuaded to reside in naples to create 30 new cardinals and refusing no one proceeded to grant beneficiaries and offices to all and sundry sometimes in his innocence even to several rival claimants simultaneously in no time the affairs of the curia were in utter disarray after a 5 month reign peter issued an edict declaring the pope's right to resign and then on the 13th of december freely resigned because of his loneliness his desire for a more perfect life and his advanced age and infirmities and his ignorance and inexperience in world affairs he fled back to the mountains he so loved but was captured after several months by the order of his successor Boniface the 8th and kept closely confined in a castle near Anagni for the fear that his enemies might make use of the simple old man for their own political ends here on the 19th of may 1296 pope peter celestine v died after 10 months of prayer and fasting he was canonized by pope clement v on the 5th of may 1313